Tarujya Krikchena Parang Padang Tata Patanti Adha. So for this pleasure only, we are making so many plans uh, according to our own brain, a teeny brain. We are making plans. Uh, there is a, uh, in a state also they are making plans, uh, personally, individually, and commercially, everyone is making plans. The plan making means becoming entangled. And they have to, uh, they have to take birth again to fulfill the plan. Vāsana. Uh, this is called vāsana. Uh, so, we have to purify the vāsana, desire. That is required. Uh, if we don't purify, then we have to uh, take birth the birth and death, repetition of birth and death. Uh. So that desire, how it can be purified? Uh. That desire can be purified. Sarvapādhi vinin muktam tatparatena nirmalam. We have to give up this uh, designation. I am, I am Brahman, I am Shudra, I am Chhatriya, I am American, I am Indian. And these have so many designations, because I am a spirit soul, but this is, this covering is my designation. So if I identify with this designation, then I will have to repeat the birth and death, uh, that you can purify. Uh, how it can be purified? Uh, that can be purified by devotion and service. When you understand that you are part and parcel of Krishna, uh, when I understand that I am eternally uh, related with Krishna. He is supreme, I am servant. And when I engage myself in His service, that is the uh, purification of desire. Uh, without Krishna consciousness, everyone is acting on different material consciousness. Uh, I am American, therefore I, I must work in this way. Uh, I must fight with the Russians, Russian thinking that I am Russian, I must fight the American or the China. So many designations. Uh, this is called uh, Maya, illusion. Uh, so we have to purify. Uh, that purification means one must know that I am not this body, I am spirit soul. Uh, so what I am doing as spirit soul? Whatever I am working at the present moment on this bodily concept of life, uh, but whatever, what I am doing uh, as spirit soul, this knowledge required. This knowledge comes when we are purified. Brahma Bhuta Prasanna Atmana Suvatati Nakaamsati Samas Sarveshu Bhuteshu Madhvakti Lavate Param. Madhvakti Lavate Param, when after being free from this material designation, Brahma Bhuta. Uh, after being free, not before that. So, bhakti is not a sentiment. Uh, bhakti, people say, those who are not very learned, cannot uh, study uh, Vedic literature very nicely, and uh, therefore they take to bhakti. No. Bhakti, actual bhakti begins when one has become completely Brahma Bhuta. Uh, Brahma Bhuta Prasannatma Nasuchati Nakankhati uh, <coughs> Samasarveshu Bhuteshu Madhvakti Lavati Pana. Uh, that, that is uh, pure stans, transcendental state of executing devotional service. After being free from material designation. Sarva Bhadi Vinir Muktam Tat Paratena Nirmalam. That is called Nirmal. That is Mukti. Because spirit soul is eternal. It has to be cleaned, the material contamination. Uh, so when it's clean, uh, then Rishikena Rishikesa Sivanam Bhakti Ruchyati. When our senses are purified, not this American hand or Indian hand, uh, it is Krishna's hand. This hand should be engaged in Krishna's service, in sweeping the temple. If he thinks like this, 
He is far, far greater than any Vedanti. If he simply knows that this hand belongs to Krishna, uh, then he is far, far greater than any Vedantis. Uh, these Vedantis, of course, all devotees, they are Vedantis. But somebody thinks that he has monopolized as a uh, Vedant. Uh, Veda means knowledge. Uh, Anta means ultimate. So Vedanta means ultimate knowledge. The ultimate knowledge is Krishna. Veda is the sadvai, ahameva vedam. So the so-called Vedantis, if he cannot understand what is Krishna, what is the meaning of that Vedanta? It has no meaning. They, the, he is perfect Vedanti who knows that Krishna is supreme, he is my Lord, I am his eternal servant. This is Vedanta knowledge. Thank you very much. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama. Rama.